welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming, where we are the voices inside your head. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Dynamite the Explosive One, and we are both playing. Well, I mean, I'm playing. Jonas is here with us. So yeah. You know, we're all here. All right, God dang it. All we're right. We're definitely here. We're playing uh, golf with your friends. Oh my God, it's haunted, dude. Is there a ghost? Uh, Aww. there might be. Aw, dude, I hope. It might be spooky. I hope you're not as scared of spooks. I I am very scared. Are you afraid of spooks? Oh my god, spirits? look, there's some scary things in oh, there. Oh my spooky horror show. God, your ball is like a I know, I can't barely a blemish see. on the red. <laughs> I just carpet. wanted it to be like a nice shade of pink, dude, and this is what I came up with. Mm -hmm. I mean <laughs> All right, I got one. I got yeah, one, Yeah, dude. You I got one. It. Hear this one. Hear this one. Give me an answer. Answer it with your best knowledge and uh, go. Here it is. If you could have any part of your body speak to you, what part of your body would it be? Why? And what do you think the conversation would be? Mm, genitals out? And absolutely not, dude. You can have that talk. Me, personally, I don't want to talk to my genitals, dude. Like, I would have a lot of explaining to do. Yeah, dude. If he's like, you put me inside that. <laughs> wow. <laughs> dude, what are you? <laughs> I don't dislike. No, I mean, I value them. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> you make it sound like I'm just abusing myself. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> Why'd you put dude, me in a toaster, I don't dynamite? Know who I, what I would talk to. Maybe, uh. My stomach, and I would be like, why are you hungry all the time, dude? I'm trying to not be so fat. <laughs> <laughs> so you just argue with your I'd be like, dumb A, quit being hungry. Just argue with your own stomach. All right, fair enough. <laughs> fair enough. <laughs> I would just cause a lot of, like, un unsettled talks in my life. Ooh. No, I don't know. I, I don't know. What about you? Hear, hear me out. I want to have a conversation with my brain, Jonas. We have a conversation with our brain all the time. <laughs> I mean, not is that is that it? Though? Don't you have an internal dialogue? Yeah, yeah. I guess it, like the closest thing I get to like talk to. Well, I talk to myself when I play video games out of habit now. But uh, the closest thing I guess I do is that internal di dialogue that I have sometimes. But, yeah, well, because I was gonna say brain myself, and I'm like, oh, we already talk to our brain constantly. But I feel like you know, like you talk to your brain, but you don't really talk. Talk to your brain. You talk to yourself inside your brain. You don't talk yeah. to the organ itself. I feel you. If that yeah. was the case, I would talk to like. Then there'd be like three voices in your head. Then you'd be schizophrenic. No. Well, I mean, we'll see. I, I'm assuming that if you can talk to your brain, like you know, verbally. I can't believe that I ran out of shots. Um, I can't. Wah, wah. I, I would like to say if I was gonna talk to my brain verbally, that I wouldn't necessarily have the internal dialogue. But I feel like if I were to talk to myself, like we're still gonna come to like some of the same conclusions. But you know, or my brain. Yeah. Oh no, it's hell. I don't know, man. I want to talk to my brain. I want to see what my brain has. What my brain can come up with. Can my brain fool me? It does all the time. My mind playing tricks on me. Yeah, it's all coming back. It's all coming back to me now. Yeah, that's dude, it's a, like a Celine that's Dion a song. Totally different song. <laughs> what is the Celine Dion song? Have to do with your brain playing tricks on you? Um, nothing. I don't know. That was like the other day we were sitting here and I thought of the song you were thinking of without you. No, this is it. not like that. It's just like that, dude. Oh, you were thinking of that Celine Dion song. I was not thinking of that Celine Dion I know that Dion you're a closet song. Celine fan, bro. I know I was, it. I was thinking of a 1980s rap song that I figured you would know because that's your forte. Nah, dude. I'm 90s You're rap, constantly right? singing night. Well, it was probably 90s. I don't actually know when it. Oh, you know, it's a freaking floating golf cart, dude. Did you see this thing? Um... Yeah, so my, for me, it'd be my brain. I figure if I talk to my, if I have to talk to my generals, dude, it's just gonna be, it's gonna be a long conversation. I'm just gonna be more embarrassed by the time it's over with. After, yeah. After the scolding it gives me. Yeah, right. Um, like, what if you had like an injured shoulder? Would you like talk to the injury and be like, "Yo, what you need to get better, man?" You know, yeah, that would be nice. Like, what can what can I do to make this work better for both of us, shoulder? Right, and it's all like, I, want, I need you to find a nice, fine young lady to rub me. I mean, that's. That's probably the conversation Jeff that's Jeff probably, would have with you. <laughs> that's probably what 90% of my body would say. Out of shots! 
Wow, dude, you suck. Dude, this is hard. Put it at seven. You put shot maximum at four. He's <laughs> just like, hold over, hold over, over, hold over. Well, if I were good at this game, I would. There's a spook, Jonas. You see it? Oh, God. He's like, Wookie Ghost Time <laughs> Factory ooh, House. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ah, ah, ah. He wants to suck your blood. Wow, dude. <laughs> some typo negative, dude. What would my hands say to me? Love it. Put me away. <laughs> like, me like that. Be like moisturizer. <laughs> Please. So thirsty. You feel like it's really warm in there. <clears throat> feet. What would your feet say to you, Joe? Tired. <laughs> <laughs> Don't put me in shoes again. Yeah, exactly. Like Quit wearing socks. And... There's a baby head. Can I? Should I, should I waste a shot to smack it? <laughs> <laughs> I mean. Oh get, my god. That should answer your own question. Kind of looks like a puppy dog face with like a baby head head. I can't tell if he's three or thirty. <laughs> Both. He's thirty-three. Alright, boom. Yeah, um hands, uh nose. What would your liver say to you? My liver is cool because I don't I'm not I've never been a uh, avid drinker. Yeah, me neither. So my, my liver would be like, bro, give me some more. Yeah, my liver would be like, hey, I'm, we're good down Those here, Sam. Back. Give me some more. <clears throat> uh, just filtrating all those uh, over-the-counter narcotics that you take. Over-the-counter. Mm, just He's like, please, give us more Sudafed. This is my last shot, dude. Oh, so close, Well, you took man. three strokes smacking a baby head. What? <laughs> I mean, strokes that were well worth it. It was. It was well worth it. Well worth the oh, rumor. Oh, boop. Downstairs, Boop. over over oh, the caught coffin. caught on that. Oh, okay. So, you, oh, there's the skill shot and even making it downstairs. Oh, boy. It's all skill, all thrill, dude. Let's it's see. Like, Can we get in the coffin around the Dracula? Around the coffin in the corner. I, I would like to be a vampire, Jonas. Why? Now, see, I'm not like one of those gothic kids who are like, oh, my name is Midian Dark. Wing and I'm Midian Darkwing, and I uh, I pretend I cosplay a vampire, but I like you know like the immortality school. They're like you don't like the daytime. I yeah, very true. I already got that going for me. So yeah, I'm already called day people day walkers. Yeah, yeah, you don't like daytime. Oh my god, just holy! I constantly see you feasting on blood. <laughs> I mean, that's Don't normal. Not on the YouTube channel, Jonas. Yeah. What if they find out? You right. <coughs> you right. I uh, uh if I was gonna be a vampire or a werewolf or a what other kind of a vampire, a werewolf, a mummy, a Frankenstein. Oh God. A fish creature. Maybe a uh, like a lagoon. Yeah, I I don't know. Uh, I think a vampire would be the best. They seem like they get the most chicks. Yeah, but you know, even beyond the chicks, there's the, you know, for the usefulness, the immortality. Yeah, you hang out with them and you feast on their youth when you're done with them? No, not, no. Is that what you mean? You're just back to girls again. I was. I like talking about girls, I dude. Know. I like I, girl. I, I, girl. I, I, girls. How's that song go? <laughs> that song from that know. movie that you used to rock out the to. The song with girl in it? Yeah. yeah so Girls every song... really turn me on. Oh, I was going to say, every song ever created, every Justin Bieber song, period. For one yeah, thing. Yeah, dude. The song with girl in it. Girls. <laughs> I like the way they talk. <laughs> I like that. Oh, you're talking about the, uh, the, the Jimmy. The, the Jimmy part. song, dude. Who was that guy? Jimmy the who? Hart. Jimmy Hart. And that was uh, off of the, the uh, what's his name with the, the strong Hulk dude, Hogan racist comments. Yeah, him, yeah, dude. dude. This plan. It's off the Bigots album. What, what is this called? Like charades when you just like say words and try to get you to say something? No, charades is no words. What's the one where I say? Uh, where like, you just say blonde hair racist? And they're like uh, Hulk Hogan. Yeah. Yeah. What's that one? Fictionary. I don't know. There is that is a game though. Yeah, well, there's one that you can say all the words, but you can't say certain words. It's like taboo. Where like you could talk about Hulk Hogan, but you couldn't say like wrestler or champion oh, or blonde. Maybe, maybe that's what it is. You could say like racist, <laughs> <laughs> Hulkamania. <laughs> no, you can't say Hulkamania. That's Hulk, Hulk is his name. You could be like racist. Uh, WWE. Yeah. F actually. 
God, that narrows it down to a few. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Racist wrestler. But they were all they were all blonde. Yeah. I remember we were watching those old wrestling uh, videos. Not that you know we make a habit of doing that, but we were watching it that one time. I was like, everybody's just a blonde-haired. Dude. And now everybody's a dark-haired guy with beard. Yeah, it's, it's it, it all comes full circle, dude. It really it's, does. Dude. That was not good. Yeah, it really does come full circle. Yeah, even Stone Cold before he was Stone Cold had lu- had luscious long blonde locks. Yeah. Stunning Steve Austin. Yeah, and then, yeah, dude. And then he actually got his claim to fame when he just cut it all off. Get in that hole, dude. Ooh. Too much, too much spice on it. Yeah, there was some spice in there. Put a little less pepper on some B-Ray right Dude, I don't, I don't like pepper. Hot take. Black pepper? I could... If I never put it on anything the rest of my life, I'd be okay. See, I like pepper, but it doesn't really have, like, a flavor to it. It just kind of like enhances the flavor of what it'll, whatever you're putting it on. Uh, yeah, if it tastes bad, because flavor pepper's bad, dude. If you want something <laughs> that tastes worse, put some pepper on that bee, dude. <laughs> what? Yeah, it doesn't have a flavor, but right. it definitely doesn't taste good. See, I think that the problem is, is that you're judging pepper too harshly because you're comparing it to its natural counterpart, which is salt. And nothing's going to beat salt. <laughs> Nothing beats salt. <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. Dude. Sugar doesn't beat salt, and sugar's delicious. Yeah, dude. Salt is, like, low-key the best. <laughs> salt is, like, the best. <laughs> it is the best. Can, you can put salt on anything. Yeah. And it's like, yo. I've definitely is... salted chocolate before. <laughs> Salted ice cream. Yeah, It's dude. amazing. Yeah, dude. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, so, dude. yeah, salt, you're, you're comparing pepper to salt. You got to put pepper in its own group, dude. You put pepper in its own group. What goes in a group of pepper, then? What's what? What goes in pepper's group, dude? It's in its own group. Oh, then I don't like that group. <laughs> <laughs> That's one I don't like. That's the group I don't want to deal I with. I don't like right, herby-ish, man. dude, and I don't like uh, pepper. Oh, you don't like seasoning. G- give me some uh, Give me some garlic. All right. Give me some salt. <laughs> some garlic salt? Garlic. All they make this stuff. Salt, Jonas, adobo? You're, gonna, you're absolutely <laughs> going to flip your ish when you find out about garlic salt. You know, what do you like, mean? There's this thing called garlic salt, Jonas. Yeah, have it. It's both of them. Yeah. They together. have garlic pepper that you had in the cupboard. It was I good, dude. Have garlic pepper. It was actually surprisingly good, dude. Yeah. It, it tricked me. I'm telling you, pepper is not bad. It does add an enhanced flavor. It's just more subtle. And like I said. Oh, I, my I, God. Look at that baby head. They're just like rehashing graphics now. <laughs> It's floating. It's the same exact thing, just bigger in green water. <laughs> <laughs> it's spooky, Jonas. Dude, I'm scared. Aren't you spooked? I'm so scared. I don't even know where the hell we I'm supposed to go. We gotta launch it, dude. I guess so. Yeah, dude. Pepper's jank. Hot take. I'm not gonna if you say like that pepper. pepper then I'm not you're gonna say, pepper liker. I'm not gonna say that pepper's great. It's definitely not like best. It's not even in my top five. All right, but. I feel like pepper gets a raw deal because it's always coupled with salt. Yeah, my grandpa used to put so much salt and pepper on his food that my grandma would like yell at him when, she, when he was eating. I think it was because all the bourbon. Salt and pepper? Yeah, like because I think he like his he his tongue would be so numb from drinking all the bourbon all night that he wouldn't taste anything. So he had to keep he would just put more and more salt and pepper. He would like eat cottage cheese and the whole top of it would be black from pepper. And then he would like salt it. My grandma would be like, Jim. <laughs> And I'd be like, this is awkward. Can I have some more ham? <laughs> oh, man. You know, you got to find yourself a, a woman that's going to yell at you. Like, everyone. Like, <laughs> oh, that's easy. Yeah. Live with them, and then they yell at you. Let me stop it. Let me stop you right there. <laughs> yeah. I've already found one. I feel like every woman and man that live together, they just yell at each other. I mean, they always just like, why don't you do this? Or why don't you do that? Why didn't you do that? <laughs> you know, dude, I don't want to make it all like the woman's the one yelling. The dude yells, too. Yeah, relationships be crazy. Yeah, dude, he's like, I came home from work and you didn't have any roast beef for me? And she's like, I was working so hard. And then she's like, what, you're out kissing other women now? Mm-hmm. Her mouth fell onto my mouth. Mm-hmm. Yeah, dude, it's just... Her mouth fell onto my mouth. Yeah, dude. She slipped, fell, landed on my mouth. And slipped out of my mouth and <laughs> fell into hers. I don't know how that Wild happened. tongues, dude. 
By the way, if you don't know that you can incorporate tongues in the kitchen, I'm sorry, kids, but there it is. Ew, gross. You can absolutely incorporate a tongue into the kitchen. If you want cooties. Yeah. Or like a baby. Post-COVID. Or a baby. <laughs> kids are good, but they can do it. Yeah, <laughs> post-COVID, man. Oh, they can they can go right ahead. CDC said he can travel now, dude. <coughs> You're vaccinated. Oh my god, I'm actually gonna get a freaking hole, dude. Nope. Never mind. Loser! Why well, I shouldn't have said anything. Nope. That's what you get for trying. Only 40 strokes over 500. And the lesson is to never, never try. try. Yeah, kids, don't try. Was that like a a silk sheet? I don't know what this is, dude. It looks like intestine to me. Is it intestine? Uh, it must be in Vegas, if you know what I'm saying. Do I go that way or do I go that way? Ooh, I go both ways. <laughs> I'm gonna go. <laughs> me to calm down. Uh, oh, I guess I was supposed to go this way. B. Whoa! Oh, there's a babies with axes. Dude, there are babies with axes. All right, you gotta go fast and hard, dude. I gotta get in here at least, because I want to see the baby axes, dude. Don't chop me! Don't chop me with your incorporeal. All right, now you gotta go super fast and hard all the way down there, dude. Just You got one stroke. Just I go know. hard, dude. Okay, you're not even wrong. I got this is my last stroke, and I can see the hole. All right. One. Next one. All right. Next one. Boom. Okay, next one. I, I, I lost my angle. Next one. All right, next one, next, next one, right there, right there, and on till morning. Boo! Hole in, oh. hole in one, boys, yeah! Yeah, he did it, folks! <laughs> hole in one. You ever seen such a good golfer? <laughs> <laughs> Anywho, all right, that's guys. all time we have for today's episode of Crazy Towns, so please make sure to like and subscribe. If you already did that, hit that notification bell. It'll be uh, like ringing the ding a ding and all over your phone for Jonas. Ooh, ooh! <laughs> that too <laughs> we are out